Okay, but wouldn't it be funny if I just did the world's fastest just like for fun? I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it just for fun. How many times would you natural three The Giant Slayer was definitely the right play, but this is funny and I've already given up on this game. I contested him, not because I wanted to ruin his life. I contested him because I had a good angle for Senna and I had nothing to lose. So I was down to just gamble and see if I hit it, even though Soju was going for Senna. He was like, okay, fuck that. I don't want to contesting whole hand seven, eight. Soju still had something to play for. So he pivoted to Ash. You know what happened? He went eight. Pivots are so hard. Like, I don't mean like they require a lot of skill. They do require skill, but like, it's almost always better to just be inflexible. The guy who says, fine, I'll pivot is already like losing. In this current patch, the way to win is to lock onto your build, pray that you're uncontested. You can maybe pivot like before it's too late, but once like you've already slammed items and have like the supporting units, it's like, it's pretty much too late. At that point, you just have to gamble. There, in, in past sets TFT, if you were contested, well, first of all, the bag size would allow you to like still kind of play the game. The other thing yeah. is, um, in past sets, there were like, I would say a healthy amount of like four cost options you could pivot to if your two cost option was not good. Or like if your reroll was not good. If you wanted to play any reroll My destination is clear. in set 10, the one cost, and you like couldn't hit it or you were contested, you could play Annie too, pivot to Ari. It's almost the exact same board. The supporting units are the same. You just play Annie too until you get a level eight and then you, you sell the Annie roll for Ari. It's actually like, it's very easy and it's very fun. <laughs> Anyway, enough yapping. Sorry, I, I'm, I'm just a negative Nancy, and I should stop complaining. Let's move on. Shogun? As you wish. Come closer. <laughs> Wait, I need to see what this is. Is it money? I, it could be an item. If this is a bow, I want to... Wait, it's half a Gwinsu's. It's half a Gwinsu's. I actually, I actually like it a lot. I'm gonna do it. It's not the best spot to play it, but I just find it to be very fun. Do you want level for Cho? No, I, I need to lose Trick. This build is not playable without a bow, so you have to int. What's crazy is, even if you int for bow, you're still not likely to get it because everybody else also wants bow. Because everybody wants the Titans, and everybody knows that the bow is harder to get than the chain, so anybody who's playing Titans will lose Streak for the bow. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, I'm actually down to... Let's do this. Okay, so there is, I, I, I do have an idea. There is one guy that is uh, contesting me. There's one guy that's going Shenna. And it's definitely in my interest, or it's in his interest to hold Shens. So I need to come up with a plan. Never a dull moment. Okay, so I would be very, very curious if you could two star a Shen to nine. We're playing Ethereal Blades. I'm inting for a uh, bow so I can get Gwinsu's. And there's a massive spike at two star and then a massive, massive spike at three star. The problem with three starring is that the bag size is really small. So if even one other guy is holding Shen's, it makes it very difficult to hit. And there is definitely, I saw like three Shens already from scouting. And I mean, like, again, I don't blame them. Shen's a popular unit. So I wonder if there is ever a play where you can two star Shen to nine. That's what you could do with my old favorite augment, the boss. The one where it made your two star or two cost set turn into like a Giga Chad. You could play two star set as a tempo play, go nine, and then just like support him with good Ionian. 
All right, please let me get this bow. I swear to God, everybody always wants the bow. Oh, it's on my side. Let's go. Yeah, I see. He wanted the bow. <laughs> he was inting for Titans. The bow is just the best component in the game right now because Titans is the best item in the game. And Gwinsu's. Oh, luckily, I was the one who hit. And it was three gold. Uh, I think I do want to lose streak this. Yeah, I think I do want to lose streak this, so I'll just chill. Well, can I slam this and lose? So, looking at the best Shen items, it's Gwinsu's Gwinsu's Giant Slayer. Gwinsu's Gwinsu's Titans comes close. Gwinsu's Gwinsu's Gunblade is okay. But, like, in general, you need Gwinsu's Gwinsu's. You could settle for a Hodge. Uh, on the list of best Shen items, it's not the worst. What a large woman. Shen offers you a starter pack. Um, do you think trick shots will give me a bow? Because otherwise I want tank. I hope it doesn't give me like sword glove, but if it gives me a bow, I need it. Oh, do I want to be safe and get two guaranteed tank components? Okay, I'm a little bitch. This one's got fire. Oh, it's only one component. Yes. But yeah, I, I'm being a little bitch there, because if I got another sword, I'm actually Because there, there's like no use for a sword besides maybe on Shen, and I already have one. A glove would be okay, but like this belt is guaranteed useful. You know what? Would you guys believe me if I told you my dad was on the board? Not my TFT board. Uh, he, he's 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 uh, he's dating the chairman. So let me go ahead and um, make a request for uh, a couple interesting items. Five boobas later. Uh, he says, "Which ones do you want?" He said, "We can request three things. I'm going to request a bow." A chain and a pepperoni pizza. Why no rod? Can't be too greedy. Bro. <laughs> All right, how am I contesting? One Shen. Uh, one Shen. Okay, and I saw one more Shen. I am definitely rolling for a two-star. Here, I'll, I'll even pre-level for it. But like, I'm gonna roll for a two-star Shen, and then that's it. Uh, what can I slam here guaranteed? Redemption should be pretty safe. These items are, like, very unplayable. I can handle one sword, but two? What about BT Shen? Uh, if I remember correctly, it's not horrible. But it is very far from ideal, especially if you are um, not playing Shen 3. Let me look it up. Okay, BT is below average, but also I want to make it clear, every item is below average besides Gwinsu's uh, and Titans and Giant Slayer. Magic Wand. If that completed a Gwinsu's, I'd actually be down. Come on. Raid boss, I win the game. Raid boss. Martyr. Party is actually pretty good. Alright, Albert, you can do it. Hit a Shen 2. You're the best. Oh, wow, you're actually the best. Look. Hit a Shen 2. Shen 2. Shen 2. 2. 2. 2. 2. two. You, I, I'm not stopping until I get this Shen. I'm not kidding. I really need this Shen. What? What? <laughs> I, uh, I need to put Cho'Gath in. Okay, like, just give me a Shen, and I will actually just, I'll, I'll move on, I'll move on, okay? I'll take the Shen 1, or Shen 2, and then just go 9, okay? Like, I'll go, I'll go with my hands, I'll pick up my own ass, and I'll go throw it over there. Okay? 
I'm not asking for a lot. I know he's contested. Let me just get the, the three shins and move on. S. 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 Thank you. Target more. All right, I will go take this Shen and I will go f myself at my earliest convenience, okay? Slamming a BT does almost nothing here. It would do something for Shen 3 because he actually drain tanks at the end of the fight, but Shen 2 does not really. But I'm like so far away from being able to play the game. Maybe I do just take it. Is it ever QSS Shen? No. Unless like there's a bunch of Eternal Winters, which I don't believe there is. What up, BT Frontline? Uh, it's not very good, but maybe I'll settle for it. Definitely grab a bow here. Does Runons do anything? Not for Shen, he's true damage. True damage on hit. He doesn't uh, proc the Runons. All right, come on. Bow on a Shen. Wait, there's an Ornn too, but it requires... No, I'm taking the bow. There's an Ornn too. Holy sh... But it would require having three swords. Deathblade Shen. Oh, you know, definitely take the bow because it's like guaranteed, right? At worst, you slam Giant Slayer, which is still a good item. At best, you get another Gwinsu's. Okay, I'm not gonna roll anymore. This board should be good enough for, for a while. Wait! My opinion has changed. I should roll a little bit. I wanted to see if I could hit uh, Cho'Gath 2, Ornn 2, or Thresh 2. What a shop! Okay, two Shens. Count them with me, boys. Two Shens, and that's it. Wait. No, no, no. One Shen. Three Shens. Two Shens. Uh-oh. One guy had four, another guy had two, and I have five. What does that add up to? Eleven Shens out of the pool. How many Shens are in the game? Twenty? So there's nine left, and of the nine left, I need to get four of them. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. That's going to be very hard. Without, like, an encounter that changes the game, it's going to be very difficult. Not to mention the fact that, like, if this guy is down to hold four Shens... Wait, okay. Wait, let me count. Zero Shens. Zero Shens. Three Shens. Four Shens. Oh, man. I just saw him hit another Shen. Wait. Oh, another guy has one. Uh-oh. Why are you always so contested? I mean, this is how TFT is. The back side is so small. I'm playing a unit that is like commonly played in many builds. So like, I love the idea of this build. I, I, I would be down for this augment to be like significantly weaker if it meant on being on a unit who wasn't contested so much. It's very fun. You turn your brain off, you roll for behemoths, and then you pray that you hit the Shen, and then the behemoths are the tanks. You turn a conventional tank into like a ultra fast assassin. It's very satisfying. But like, yeah. I, a lot of the game just comes down to how many people randomly decide to hold a Shen while they're playing the rest of the game. I'll keep counting. Three. Four. So seven total. Seven total. Just go nine. I, I'm at four Shens, or five Shens. I should try. Yeah, I'm really sad that the hero arguments are on super contested units. If I didn't hit this double Shen shop, I would be down to just like move on, but like, it has got to be a sign, right? I can also hit 3-star Yorick, 2-star Cho'Gath, 2-star Thresh. Oh, I got a Gwinsus. Oh, another Gwinsus. Oh, a Yorick. Oh. This is freedom. That's potential. The grave is your home. The grave is your home. Wait, I got triple Gwinsus. Wait, I did it! <laughs> I got triple. No, 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 shut up, Albert. It's definitely just Giant Slayer. 
Okay, but wouldn't it be funny if I just did the world's fastest Shen just like for fun? Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it just for fun. How many times would you natural three Gunsus? The Giant Slayer was definitely the right play, but this is funny. And I've already given up on this game. Okay, I definitely like already lost this fight because I didn't slam Giant Slayer. Yeah, if I slam Giant Slayer, I would have won this. All right. Um, oh, final ascension. Three shens. Wait, they sold their shens. I can hit. I can hit. This is not a drill. I can actually hit. I can actually hit. This is not a drill. The Shen players have sold their Shens. Next round, we go to zero. Go get him, world's fastest Shen. Pew, pew, pew. Don't worry, when Final Ascension kicks in, it's over. Every single time he casts, laser beams, that's just one shot. The world's fastest Shen. Pew, pew, pew. Is it trolling? Absolutely. He kept on attack speed so early. The Giant Slayer would have been fine. Arguably a lot better, because then I could have killed that Diana. But this is fine. This is funny. I need two S's. It's not contested. Or I should say, it's barely contested. Come on. I will roll to zero for this. I know you're out there. Don't take this. I know you're out there. I know you're there. Shen, please exist. Don't worry. I'm sure, I know it looks bad, but I'm sure like a double Shen shop has come up any second now. Target marked. Target marked. Let's go! It's time! It took me so long to hit, but I got it. I was contested for so long, but I found the moment that they all sold. And it only took me 70 gold to hit four shins. That's actually not too bad. Not, not that below average. All right, I threw the game by slamming triple Gwinsus, but honestly, I think it's still winnable. It's funny. What's the best sword I can make here? It's just another BT. This York is so thirsty. <laughs> the thirstiest York in the West. Sterex is really good. Are you sure it gives AD? Completely wasted stat. It gives health, but like I'd rather just have the Omni Vamp and the, um, the shield and the AP. All right, Albert, if you want to play for our fourth, you level up and put in this Nico to give HP to your whole team. If you want to play for our first, you sit. Check this out. Kindred three, Nar three, no problem. Let's look at his attack speed, shall we? Everybody just, uh, objective, survive. How long does it take Shen to hit max attack speed? Come on, Shen. Final ascension. One shot the Gnar. Pew, pew, pew. My god, he's doing it. Is there a cap on attack speed? Yes, 5.0. That's why slamming three Grinches is really troll. But it's funny. I did it for you. Rewarded! Rewarded!
rewarded for sitting! Oh my god! <laughs> I mean, now I'll happily level. <laughs> I'll level. I'll happily level to 8 next round, too. Okay, I'm down to see how much attack speed is wasted. Like, how early are we hitting 5.0? Because if you hit it really fast, it's like a lot of attack speed wasted. If I was a Chad, I would put Shen up here so that he can protect his team. It's a little risky, though, because he might just, like, get caught and die because he doesn't have any, any healing. Yeah, he'll be fine, he'll be fine. Oh no, the Yone might actually kill him. No, no, Shen's a big boy, he'll survive. He has zero Omni map, he'll survive. We got Marty. Marty here in Final Ascension, this is perfect. All right, look at Shen's attack speed. How long into the fight does he hit 5.0? Oh, he just kills the Yone. Oh, it actually takes him a while to hit 5.0. Oh, wait, it actually... Oh. He actually didn't hit 5.0 attacks. Oh, he hit at the very end. Honestly, is this even bad? He's not even wasting the attack speed. It's not even bad. Okay, I'm gonna pump EXP as much as I can. We go nine. Yeah, it's not even that bad. You're not wasting that many stats. I wish it was an augment that let you put a fourth item on a unit. You know how strong Yone is right now. <laughs> Imagine Gargantuan triple tights. <laughs> Wait! Guys, what if I had an augment <laughs> that let me <laughs> go beyond the limit and go four Gwinsus on my Shen? <laughs> okay, Cho'Gath's the one who goes when you hit um Udyr, so. All right, make me proud, son. We've got Martyr, we've got six Behemoth, we've got a bunch of tank items, and we've got three Gwinsus. Your objective is to just live for 15 seconds and let Shen handle the rest. This Diana 3 was too tanky, but I've got final ascension this time. Boom, see ya, two shot. He's unstoppable. Should he get Shred? No, this guy does too much true damage. Yeah, Diana 3 instantly gone. How can you handle 100% increased damage, 654 true damage times three every two seconds, then times 1.45. Wait, is this? Your team does 15% more damage. After 15 seconds, they deal 45% more damage. Does that mean you go from 15 to 45 or 15 to 60? I think it's 60. Wait, there's so many multipliers on my Shen. Like, 100%, that's the spirit. Look at this Galio not die for a little bit, and then the moment Ascension kicks in, it's just over. Oh, actually, he's already kind of dying. This is like Ultra Biss Augments. Holy crap, if, if only I had Raid Boss, but like, otherwise it's perfect. Three autos, three kills. Okay, it's not three autos, three kills, but it's fine. He's also Ultra Tanky. Wait, oh my god, you could call the, the video Final Ascend Shen. Fuck, I'm so funny. I, I stole that from someone in my Twitch chat. Blessing. It's literally just a wall. Listen up, soldiers. You're here because you're the best of the best. That's not actually true. You're here because you share a trait with my carry. What is your purpose? Die for the country. For Super Earth! Hello, Avenged Dara. Thanks for the two months. Look at Orn going in to spread democracy! Box box, I just got here. How is your Shen ranged? Oh, um. Uh, one second, I'll shoot. Wait, another Gwinsu's. Faded Udir. Is that Foodir?
Um, if you're having trouble understanding what is going on right now, here, I can help you. Let me do some uh, movie magic, some uh, video editing to help you. Okay, ready? There we go. Think of it like that. It's Bard. Bard three, baby. Doot, 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 doot. But surprise, it was actually a Shen. Yeah, Box Box editors are sweating right now. They're like, oh, fuck. Box Box does their job better than I do. Uh, can't get a better faded unit. Wait, you don't even need faded. My journey's only beginning. I'm gonna put him in the middle. Oh! Oh, I regret this. Uh-oh. This Udyr 2 could actually get in. People's boards are hitting their end game. Shen, you gotta do something! Final Ascension! Hurry, hurry! Uh-oh. I actually think I lost. Wait, hang on! This is the bloodthirstiest Yorick you've ever seen! Look at the moves! Look at the healing! Yorick! What is that? He's sucking the Zaya! Wait, is that at least in three? Wait! Wait, that's at least in three! Wait, 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 wait. Wait. That's eight least sins. Uh oh. Wait, do I beat the crab? I mean, I've got HP, but like, I feel like Shen should. This, this is a build that Shen should win. People die, and then Martyr procs. Like, it's free. Yeah, Shen actually destroyed this guy. That was awesome. This is freedom. Okay, everybody beat it. All right, roll for Udyr too. I also need to hold a Lee Sin. Wouldn't wish my fate on anybody. Stand back! It's the Miko coming through! What the? Oh, what the? I held the greatest of blessings. Time to die. I cannot believe BT BT Redemption York is actually popping off. But he's actually like Shen's best friend right now. Alright, final battle. Ooh, am I gonna sell set for Thresh 3? Oh, wait, my editors do a YouTube animation every single time we hit a three star, right? No! It's fine. Okay, let's see it. The world's largest Diana versus the world's fastest Shen. She'll live for now. But I'd like to see what she can do once Final Ascension kicks in. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, Shen. Do your thing. You're scaled up. Every two autos, someone dies. 
Hey, is it just me or is this kind of close? It's not! Beautiful gameplay, Shen! Triple Gwinsu's Final Ascension, Martyr, the Giant Wall! What a game. We were contested for so long, we waited for the moment they all sold, and then we rolled down like a psycho. Wow, what a funny augment. If only they weren't so contested all the damn time. Yeah, Ascension. Final Ascension. I can't believe we actually made all the swords work out. That's probably like the biggest tragedy. All right, noted. If you can get triple Gwinsu's, triple Gwinsu's is actually this. Please, 